I'll be showing how to create a PLC team and use it inside of Microsoft Teams. And we know from John Hattie's research that collective teacher efficacy is a top indicator for student outcomes. So I'm here on the Home tab. I'm going to join or create a team. And we'll click Create Team. And I'm going to choose a professional learning community. Now, let's give it a name. And I'm going to make it so it's private where only team owners can add members. I could change this and make it public so anyone in the organization can join. And then I'm going to hit Next. OK, click Add. And they're all members. I'm the owner. We'll hit Close. So now I'm in my Pineview PLC. And of course, we're going to give it an image. So I'll add an image. There we go. Now, what comes inside of your PLC team? Well, of course, you get posts. And this is where all your conversations and messages are. So I'll give a welcome message. Hello, everyone. I like to add a sticker. There we go. We have a Files tab. So this is where I can upload Word documents, lesson plans, PowerPoints. I could just go to Upload here and Upload Files. Or I could actually just create a new file. Maybe I'm going to create a new Word document. Now, one of the best parts is the PLC OneNote Notebook. Let's click that. I talk to so many educators that have binders, paper binders that they use for school. And especially with distance learning, wouldn't it be great to have a full digital binder for your PLC? Now, I've expanded this. And you can see we pre-create a set of sections and pages in this PLC binder. So things like creating norms, different roles in the PLC, how can you create goals, and the plan, do, and check is based on the very popular do fours model. And so you can have your norms and your roles. How are you going to capture data and collect data? And you can have your whole binder all set up and ready to go. And so now you can collaborate much easier digitally in your PLC. The other nice thing that you can always do inside of Teams is meet. And so if you want to have a meeting with your other PLC members, you can just click the Meetings button and then meet now. And so I can meet with other PLC members. I can schedule meetings. All of those things are baked right into this PLC.